As more people get their coronavirus vaccines, we're getting an updated picture about the state of the pandemic in Florida. The White House releasing this report over the weekend, showing how the pandemic has changed across all 50 states. The first major takeaway from the White House's most recent Florida report, they say new COVID cases are going down. Dr. Aftab Khan treats coronavirus patients in Central Florida and says this drop comes after the spike during the holidays. He worries another could be coming. Now um, my biggest concern that these numbers will not hold on because what happened yesterday in Tampa was mind boggling that thousands of people were walking on the street without, nap without masks, without having any social distancing. The second major statistic from recent White House data, hospital admissions in Florida are falling. The bad news is uh, Florida is becoming hotspots for new UK variants B117. As new reports of the more contagious strain pop up in Florida, the White House's last major data point, deaths in the state are still going up and down. This, as state data shows resident deaths on Sunday, dipped below 100 for the first time since early January. While that is a daily improvement, looking at recent months as a whole, nearly a third of all deaths in Florida happened in just the past couple months. A worrisome trend, says Dr. Khan. This is my biggest concern by spring and summer. The new variants will take a hold on Florida and we will be facing a new surge from these new variants. In Orlando, Marley Martinez, WESH 2 News.